they have the materials to do well in the FIFA World Cup to the stage in Costa Rica later this year. And apart from them, there will also be the Commonwealth Games that will be happening in Birmingham, which is going to be in July, August. Well, the uh, president of the Ghana Hockey Federation has been speaking about how he wants his team to intensify their preparations to ensure that they go to the games and give a good account of themselves. Preparations are going very well. As you recall, both our men and women's team have been invited to, to partake and participate in the Birmingham Commonwealth Games. And um, they've started off-site training and probably a month before time we would get them all to the hostel to train. But we are working on this in conjunction with the Ghana Olympic Committee, GOC. In, in terms of our preparatory efforts and in terms of facilities to actually help our teams actually partake in this in a very meaningful way. I think, I, I think both our men's team and our women's team are well placed in Africa. Um, probably the women's team a little ahead of the men's, but we believe that the Commonwealth teams in Africa, which will exclude Egypt for instance, gives us an opportunity to actually place even higher within the African contest. But Commonwealth, I think we would make a show in on behalf of Africa as a Ghanaian set of teams. Funding for what we call the lesser known sports um, could be improved. I think the government has done its part and is doing as much as they could. But we want to extend the call also to corporate entities to come and help us actually fund such trips and also such engagements. And we believe that certain corporate bodies that we have actually contacted will come through and help supplement what GOC has to be able to take our teams over to Birmingham.